April 12th. Right? And what is they April 12th celebrating? Well, the, the Julian calendar added days, took away days so it would line up with their their pagan lesson. And the Vatican has made Esther or Isis worship, Marian worship, human worship, worship besides the Lord Jesus Christ. And a lot of religions have got weird symbols like the hat on the popes or Dagon from Baal time, from the Baal, Marduk. <laughs> you can go all the way back in the ancient times and see that in historically. And the, all the little emblems, the pine cones, the eggs, the rabbit, the fertility goddess, Esther, Easter. Uh, Isis Horus is a young child at birth that's been introduced as the Marian worship. So if you do your research, you can find out a lot of things in our world. But we're here to continue on with this new character, Sharan. He's an Andorian. And we're doing the SS Azura rescue mission. So without further ado, let's go. It'll start right into it. I got kicked off earlier. And maybe this will put me right back into it. And we'll get right back into the story mode there. I call this in 4A. <clears throat> because I did it crashes every now and then when you're playing certain missions I don't know why but it does it likes to crash uh, Star Trek is notorious for crashing especially when you uh, go to it did crash real bad when you switch to the Jim Adar it may crash again uh, we, you never know <laughs> it depends so it looks like it's going to be so, if you go up here, fly your ship up here to the SS, so we can begin stranded, hit X, so it should load nicely, now that we crashed once, we should be okay, then again, you never know with uh, this type of games, <laughs> there's a lot of history in America, I mean, there were giants found all over the planet. Uh, there was uh, the early explorers talked to people that were seven to ten feet tall back there, but it's all been hidden by the Smithsonian, and I don't know why. If you look at Netflix, you can find a thing about giants being found on the earth, big big people, and you know, and they had six fingers, and they found uh, archaeologists have found stuff, and that's that's what they think. So it's in all them mounds. The mounds are giants. That's what they think. So you answer this Please call help. to her. We're being pursued by a Travail. Crew injured. Taking heavy fire. So this is kind of a weird mission here. You got it's kind of like both on the that. And uh, there's all kinds of people attacking it. You gotta rescue rescue it, and of course it's Klingon mainly. You get, here comes some scout ships. You gotta take these out, which aren't too bad. Don't ever play with someone that's a higher rank than you. If you think you're going to get by, don't do not do it. It ain't. Like I say, you can't fire on them until you get 10,000 kilometers. Take your time. Make sure you, if, if they got any devices, you want to get them. In the gas course. Yeah, you get Oculates for everything, so just bring that up and boom, you got it. We won't get any more of them because we ain't got time to really mess with them. We want to do the story. We can always come back and do these and get these if you want.
some ships are more tougher than others. I'll just tell you. So they get, apparently they got enemies on there, which is good. You got to go over and rescue them. <clears throat> it's a fun game if you like Star Trek and all that. They got several new things going. As, as you can see, my earlier videos, uh, if you look on there, you can see that where I played one of them the first the rocket launch first contact I came in second place which is alright Slow and slow, ain't it? Captain, I'm concerned about the radiation on the Azura. She might have some damage to the warp core, but our sensors can't pick up enough to... Alright. You can play with friends on here and stuff. But... There's probably things in here if you hit your thing it'll tell you that you can get right over here see and pick up things small hypo cling on glass And of course, these are scans. You can scan these and pick up extra items. Like if you get it like that, you will get the full amount. Certain, uh, like engineers and science, got different things they can do in the game, and that's good. All right. way I got turned around didn't I it's easy to do we need to go up there where the plasma's coming out so once we go up here we can take this out we're going up here
course you want to go up here <laughs> they hop around a lot don't they You want to go up to talk to Captain Brock? We hid in a Ryan ambush on our way. I'll never, I'll never let those go. green pirates. Pirate. And the engineer would let you do more, so all you gotta do is go out here and there's a tactical. Of course, there'll be more. Here comes the enemy. Cling on, of course. So you can go up here. It's an op optional tactical. See now that that's you got a better energy dampening outfit, you can put this uh and you can get L C on with a better suit. Rest of them you can just sell. Then you get into a fight, battle, ship battle, and it's pretty much over with after that. That's kind of cool. It's sunny here in southeastern Ohio. Hope everybody's doing good this day. Keeping social distance. And staying uh, healthy. Eat plenty of blueberries and strawberries and bananas. and Make sure you get plenty of vitamin C, A, D. Get out and get some sunlight. That'll help you get vitamin D levels up to help you ward off any kind of colds or th bad things. Blueberry plums are real good. So.
See, that's a blue one. That's something definitely you want to look at, a blue. You saved my crew. I'll tell you what. So you can always go down here and hail well Starfleet. You saved that crew. Congratulations, Lieutenant. So we need to depart for the system. Some missions are going to be hard. Some missions is just going to destroy you. They're really tough. They'll be like birds of prey and certain uh, ships that are way beyond your hurt. So you just go ahead and play the game and keep going until you get rid of it. That's all you can do. So our next mission is... We're leveling right up. Let's go ahead. Every, after every mission, make sure because you're going to get unlock items. Make sure you go to your ship, go to your skills, your captain skills. Uh, every skill costs one point of the same type to purchase. You will earn one space point every one. Every skill costs one point of the same type to purchase. You will earn one space point every one level and one ground point every five levels until you reach level 50. For each skill purchased, you will earn progress and unlock paths. Little better shielding. Little better engines. Definitely want that on there. You can put this stuff on them. That's what I usually do, just work on my staff, so we'll go back into missions here and see what's next. So we're on the Klingon War. Researcher. This is a fun one. Starfleet has lost contact with the Federation Science Station in the Kasei system. Because all communications from Kasei 2 must be boosted by a satellite. And of course it tells you where to go. We're going right down here to Kasi system. I 
if we're going down through there we can look at look at thing you can look at your crew stations you unlock these two as you go I see some things you can get here. <laughs> now. Hidden dangers lurk in space, and the threat of Klingon attacks you can't has made even the most stout-hearted reconsider their choice to travel throughout the stars. A last ditch effort to find a common ground. The ship will be a little bit bigger, no better. the ship like it is it'll be a little better just a little better yeah this is a free ship you get Kind of comes in handy, I think. Like I say, you know, it's got more firing. As I level up, it's going to unlock at a later level, see. So it's got more fire arm armaments for me to uh, manipulate, you know. So, And, you know, you can manipulate all that. So I think it's worth it. The, I believe also the other ship's pretty powerful. <clears throat> the Vulcan ships and all that. We're almost there. You can even put extra photons on it. I think it'd be good to have good more phasers, that's for sure. Research rescue. Nice. Hello, welcome to the stream. We're just kind of playing early Star Trek missions. Started all over with our uh, Starfleet. You can play different factions, of course. You can play Klingons. You can play as anything. You can play as Romulan. So it kind of gives you the versatile thing. So you can see here, you can see all the enemies up here that we're going to have to go fight. Kind of give me a heads up to what's going to happen. 
kind of glad that I went to this ship. It's a really cool storyline if you play through all of them as you go. That cause if you get ahead of yourself, some of them can be very, very difficult and you you'll find yourself dying and get discombobulated a lot. <clears throat> Fire extinguisher.
another week. Ships are very powerful. Now we gotta go down there and take on uh, there's like three beaming satellites and they get if we disable the shield shield So we gotta take out these shield generators. I think that's this is the funniest mission of all. Increase the power to the shield, you fools! <laughs> oh, it's hilarious. You gotta love it. Now, if you increase, if you want to, if you want to be level 65 and replay this, they'll be tough. They'll be tougher. I guess you could uh, help your friends out if you wanted. As you can see, it's pretty easy to take them out. I think it's funny to listen to him. He's funny. <laughs> you mean competent fools? <laughs> Oh, 
All you gotta do is run out here when he throws. Oh, I guess he can throw through it. That ain't right. Make sure you open your container. There's nothing really here, just. There's no sign of it. <laughs> you incompetent fools. <laughs> ah, that's funny. Makes me laugh. You are you meddling in affairs you do not understand. <laughs> this system was the home of our ancestors. It belongs to the gore by ties of blood and conquest. We will not allow <clears throat> grave robbers and thieves to desecrate our own ground without punishment. Prepare for death. So that's that. <clears throat> there is an advantage how you get this ship early. You don't, you can unlock it by when you do certain events. And that's how I got it. I, I done an event and got a ship. So now I have this. So. Every skill costs one point of the same type to purchase. You will earn one space point every one level and one ground point every yep. five levels until you reach level 50. For each skill purchased, you will earn progress and unlock Commander powers. Commander Burgess, Starfleet Intelligence. There's something I'd like you to look into. Admiral Quinn says you... Go to the bar patch. Secret orders. This is mission secret orders.
Right for the donut. Got a cloak. I didn't know it had a cloak. Beam me down. 
So this will be the last mission we play. We'll complete this and we'll move on to the we'll end this 4A. Don't worry, don't fear oh part five will have more story missions in it and complete this Klingon uh story. Happy to tell you what I know, but ask the Klingons. They want a weapon. There are proto. All right, you can quit fire. <laughs>
भीमर साहब Action report filed by Lieutenant Gunzeal. Pity we weren't able to apprehend the Vox, but I'm glad we shot that weapons facility down. Nicely done. Admiral Gracious. leveling up nicely I think I was level five and now we're up getting on up there so we'll be continuing to cling on front the cling on front we're going to do the doomsday device it's kind of fun it, it can be challenging you can die quite a few times which is all right with me <laughs> it's all right That happens. You have a new captain power available in your radio menu. Press the L2 button to show all your powers. Use the left stick to navigate this radio to set your quick power and update the default captain power to use. Every skill cost trigger to activate a power to register on this radio menu. One space point every one level and one ground point every five levels until you reach level 50. So we're going to continue the Klingon War. The Doomsday device will be next. And there's only seven, eight more, two more parts. Admiral Quinn says you're the right right. And as you can see, we're going right here to the, this system. So as you can see, I'm level seven now, so we're moving right along there. So, so as you're flying through the air, that's the time to start looking at all your items that you can put on your ship. 
And there ain't nothing here, nothing there, nothing there. Got a phaser damage. Uh, all damage resistance. I think I better have that. You can see we can't put our high three things on yet, but we can definitely give our other people some better equipment so they don't get hurt. So. We'll start here again tomorrow or later. So. We'll just go ahead and stop right here. Hey, thanks for watching, everybody. We'll continue the Klingon War with the Doomday device on Part 5. Anyhow, have a great Easter. Stay safe. Stay social distance. Take care of your elderly and your family and people of high risk. And that's all it's about, man. Taking care of one another. Don't, go, don't give in to fear. Don't panic. Don't go nuts. Don't become a tyrant. Because a lot of people have been come. I'll give you an. End. There was a woman that has it, and she ran into the hot ran to the hospital after she was told to go home. She don't have that bad of symptoms, but she's panicking. She's going home, and she went to the doctor, and the doctor gave her the devil for her coming because she didn't follow instructions. And that's what happens when people don't follow instructions. Bad things happen because people don't listen. Period. But anyhow, I hope you all stay safe. Thanks for watching. Enjoy the videos.